What's going on? What's going on? Hey, it's your boy Skills. How y'all doing? All right. What's up? Hey, it's your boy Willie J, aka Houston Gamer. Hey, what's going on? How y'all doing? All right. So, who am I? I'm a professional journalist. I write about video games for the Houston Chronicle video game blog, Houston Gamer. All right. Houston Chronicle is the biggest newspaper in Texas, one of the biggest in the United States. So, what I do for the Chronicle? I write about companies. PR firms, developers, publishers, and like to send me games for review. I do that kind of stuff. Well, anyway, I didn't get anything in the mail today, but I got a couple things I wanted to show you, right? So, if it's not a let me be clear, if it's not an unboxing, what is it? That's right. Say it with me, y'all. One, two, three, score! Okay. So, got a couple scores in there. One of them is, is hot, y'all. Seriously. All right, so... I was at my favorite, one of my favorite pawn shops is actually right down the road, and I was able to get, now this is the old school iPad 1, right? I actually have never owned an iPad. I have an iPhone 4. Now, I've never really gotten to the iPads. I'm not really big into tablets, but I was like, hey, you know what? I saw it, looked at it, I said, eh, you know, it's the first generation, did some research, realized I can't upgrade past OS 5.1, but I said, you know what? Still, the 64 gigs. Hmm. So I asked myself, well, how much I want for it? They told me the price, and I was like, really? So I started thinking, I'm like, you know what? Even for the price in its first generation, and it works good, I mean, it has really good battery life, still, the price they were asking, I was like, so I thought about it, and I went ahead and put it on layaway, right? When I came home, Google it. The cheapest one I saw was anywhere from 60 to 70 bucks more expensive than this. So I had already had it on layaway, went ahead, took it out of layaway. Alright, guess how much I paid for this first gen, alright, first gen 64 gig iPad. That's pretty, pretty close, alright. So I actually got this for a hundred dollars. All right, 100 plus tax was 107, but hey, I've been playing around with it. You know, I got some pretty, pretty crazy stuff on here. Matter of fact, I tell you what, let's go ahead and look like y'all can see some of that stuff. I have this one um, video. Let me see, is this it? Ah, no, that's not it. All right, and actually, I use it on portrait mode, no, like landscape. Okay, it's this one right here. Now, check this out. i let y'all see a little bit of it. This boy straight owned this cat. Alright, that dude... <laughs> Alright, this is actually... <laughs> it was this thing that's called Zangief Kid. So was, I guess this cat was in Australia, New Zealand, someplace down there. Y'all got to forgive me, my peeps down there. But anyway, what happened is this boy was bullying him, and the boy just snapped, and he went straight Zangief on him. I'm talking about straight atomic dropped his tail. But anyway, so 100 bucks. So what do y'all think, y'all? Is that a score? I think so. All right, so let's say it with me, y'all. One, two, three, score! Okay, so now this right here is actually two pieces. All right, so... At the same pawn shop, all right, on a different day, what ended up happening is <clears throat> I have a Canon XSI Rebel um, digital, um, digital SLR, and a lot of times, like, I'm looking for lenses, a specific type of lens. The lens I wanted is a 75 to 300 millimeter. Now, historically, the price is anywhere from 50. I sent them for 50. To like a hundred, twenty five hundred, fifty bucks. But honestly, I'm looking more than fifty dollar range, right? So what happened is I actually saw this. Now this is a rebel, and this is a rebel. A dig. This is not digital. It's film. You know, it's actually got some film in there. I don't know if you can see it, but this right here, I saw it, and I was like, okay, I'm not looking for a camera. All right, I am definitely not looking for another camera, especially. You know, a film. Well, the thing is, what's really cool, if you get a Canon film a film camera that uses like the EF or the EFS lens, then it actually can work on the digital. So you can pick up a whole lot of really, really cool lenses at a cheap price 
you know, if you go that route. Well, they had both of these. Lens that, like, actually, this is what I saw. I saw this. I was like, oh, snap. I'm like, that's pretty cool. So I said, well, how much for that? And um, the attendant said, well, that right there goes with the camera. And I'm like, for that price? So I got two lenses, right, and the camera. And the camera, I'm just going to flip that for maybe 20 bucks. But here's the thing. This is what's gold. And I actually hooked it up to my Canon. Canon was like, boom, it works. So I'm like, real, for real, though? Okay. So here's the thing. How much did I pay for this right here? This is a 70 to a 300 millimeter glass. All right, works great. Okay, and then this right here is a standard 35 to 80. I actually have an extra one of these, but camera works. So I got two lenses and I got this body. How much did I pay for it? Mm -mm. No. Mm -mm. How much did I pay? Let me see if you can see this or not. Can you see that? $27 for this lens, this lens, and this body. $27, okay? $27. I asked the lady, I'm like, seriously? She was like, look, I got this, and I was just trying to move it. Look, I started praising the Lord. I was about to speak in tongues up in there, y'all. I was like, Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Not Jesus from the South Valley. I actually, no, you know what? I know Jesus. And that's another thing. How come his, you know, like, all my Hispanic peeps, like I said, my, my peeps down in Mexico, you know, in Costa Rica, Puerto Vida. That's one thing I'm trying to figure out. How in the world y'all be calling kids Jesus? Now, don't get me wrong. I know y'all pronounce it Jesus, but come on. It's still spelled J-E-S-U-S. That's Jesus, y'all. Okay? That is Jesus. Christo. Jesus, not Jesus. Well, y'all know Jesus from the um, from the valley. He got a funky 6 foot. But anyway, 27 bucks, y'all, for all this. 27 bucks. Glass. Both of these glasses are awesome. Well, this one's got a crack in it, but I could still flip it. I could actually flip all of this. Like, I'm keeping this right here. But I could flip this, like... 20 for the for the for the frame matter of fact you can you can probably see right there but 20 for the for the body another 20 because it still works so that's 40 and guess what I got I made $13 in profit off the whole deal just like the iPhones I flipped each one of those so anyway y'all say it with me okay check this out since this was so awesome we're gonna say it three times all right one two three hit me score 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 So, from the same pawn shop, all right, y'all? Bet. Okay, so I got this, and I got this. Yeah, exactly. So, all I got to say is, thank you, Jesus, for hooking a brother up. All right. So, anyhow, I'm coming right back at y'all. Um, another video. So anyway, just let me know like recent scores that y'all have had and everything. So anyway, it's your boy skills. Thank you so much for tuning in. All that ass should be like right there or maybe like over up in here or maybe down there. Hey, add, like I said, all the information below the ad. Boom, you're good to go. Hit me up on Twitter at M4DSCatWomanZ, also Houston, at Houston Gamer, all one word. Hit me on my official um, Houston Gamer blog, and that's HoustonGamer.com. It goes right to my um, Houston Chronicle video game blog. And like I said, just get at me and everything. Hey, look, you know what? Most of the time, unless it's just a really popping video, you want to ask me a question, you know, you want to respond, you know, you want a response. Most of the time I will, as long as you're not being a smart aleck or anything. Anyway, it's your boy Skills, so I'm coming right back at y'all. Talk to y'all later. Deuces.